What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So today, before we start our new project, I really want to fix this exhaust. So I want to take it, see if it's still hot, a little bit hot. Take it, turn it down there, um, and re-sleeve that because it burned the plastic. You can see right there where it burned the plastic. So I want to remount the plastic. I may end up just taking this out maybe coating this black um, but clean this up so it'll go back in there get that in there possibly put that in there as well um, I move the exhaust and the other thing I want to do is the steering because of the way I did it it's underneath it's super low um, so I'm gonna switch where it's mounted on the pitman arm I'm gonna pull it up on the pitman arm. Um, so it's like on the top of the pitman arm. So on top, instead of underneath. That'll give me some more clearance on the cart. <clears throat> so that's what we're gonna do today, guys. Do. So that's what we're gonna do today, guys. We're gonna fix the steering, fix the exhaust. I'm gonna throw you guys on a time lapse for this. Going forward, I'm gonna do less time lapses, except for like certain things. Um, I'm trying to change up the style of video shooting and editing. Um, hope you guys like the way the channel starts going with all that stuff, because let's face it, I'm not a great editor. I just like doing projects. Oh yeah, got my little welding area set up. Got my TV so I can watch some TV while I'm working. Got paint cans and cleaners and wasp spray got all the tools up here for the most part There's general garage stuff there saw donkeys some more stuff over there a little table for um, fabrication right there all right let's go ahead and jump right on into this thing I tell you what, it is hot out here. Ever since I got sick, I just sweat like crazy now. But the good news is, we're done. Got the exhaust down, right down there. Up and around, tucks. The torque converter. I was gonna run the muffler, but I decided not to run the muffler. Um, oh yeah. Put the tie rods on the top. So we're good there. Tie rods are on the top. Further away from the ground, a little bit safer. Battery actually did pretty good. It was at uh, 12 and a half, 13 volts. And then we've got this. Um, we got some uh, hot glue kind of put it over just so it's seal take a razor and go back and clean this up and it shouldn't be all too noticeable but I think what we're gonna do today is I think we're gonna go for a little ride because we still got mm, 30 minutes of daylight and why not all right guys let's take this thing for a ride
aqui. Nossa, mas aqui, ué. Ah, que sacos. Yeah, man. Key light came out somewhere. Well, that sucks. Well, I guess we gotta push it back. That was fun. Uh, <laughs> it broke down. Uh, the uh, key came out of the axle. So I'm gonna use those lock collars, put one on each side, keep it tight, keep that key in there. And I might also need to look at my brake to see if the same thing happened to it. So, yeah, it was a good run. As you can tell, I'm kind of out of breath. We did 30 miles an hour. So it is what it is. All right, guys. Well, next video is going to be foot pegs, wearing pants, and uh, keyways, possibly lock collars on the axle. And then we'll do the next project. You guys want to see a peek of it? Let's go inside. Take a peek. Might be too dark. That's a perfect way to leave the video, right?